Hey, how you doing? This is Derek Erguin here, and today I'm going to show you how to place your video, your YouTube video, anywhere on the web, and have it play automatically whenever the viewer goes to watch it. But I will let you know that right off the bat, there is a warning to this, and make sure that you read all the information on my blog page to be able to understand what that is. And I, the reason why I put it there is to really cut down the production time here. So let's go ahead and get started. Head on over to YouTube, and what I want you to do is find the video that you're looking to share. And after you do that, head on down to where it says embed, and you're going to grab this embed code, okay? After you have selected it and copied it, what I want you to do is post it inside of a text edit or some other source for you to be able to view the code, okay? Now, notice here that in this code, there is quite a bit of information. You don't need to know much other than that, the, that there's a specific width and height of an actual video. Um, there are two things here I want you to notice, that it has this kind of information in two locations, okay, one right here and another one right here, all right, that basically means that there are two places within inside of this code that we're going to change information. And the first one is that what I want you to find is right after it says width and height, you're going to find where the quotations begin. And after the quotations, you're going to follow it down. Here it shows you where the video is coming from. You're going to find, you're going to scroll and find all the way to where it has this term or these group of words called rel equals zero and after that zero what I want you to put is the word or the uh, the letter and or the the sign for and which is shift seven and you're gonna type in auto play equals one and what you're gonna do is you're gonna find the other location that it also says rel zero so find where it says quotations and you're gonna scroll down to the end where it says rel equals one and do the same thing there too Okay, so after you do that, now you've got a code that basically says this is the video and it's going to auto play and the number one means yes, that it will play in computer language. So after that, you're going to copy it. You're going to head back over to your post or wherever it is you want. Now this one's going on my blog post and I'm going to post it in the HTML section of my blog post just like this. And because I want this video to be in the center, here's a little bonus, I guess. I'm going to go ahead and center it. And these brackets really are just telling the computer where this thing's going to be placed. Now, to be able to end everything that's going to be centered, as you can see right here, I'm centering this video. This one is where I'm going to tell the computer that I'm going to stop centering anything on this page. And that's what that slash means. It basically means to close the command. And after that, all you have to do is hit publish or save the page or do whatever it is that you're looking to do. And I'm going to do this right now. I'm going to hit publish. As you can see here, I'm on my blog site. I'm going to go ahead and see what this looks like now that I have already posted a brand new um, article here on the page. And voila, there you go. I've got my visual here. And as soon as somebody goes to this actual page to view it, notice it'll start playing right off the bat. So here we go. As you can see, it's starting to play right now. Now it's loading, so sometimes depending on the computer or how big the file is or whatnot, it's going to change for some people. So uh, that's pretty much it. I've got the four steps right here. Head on over to your YouTube channel, grab the code, change where it says rel equals zero by adding the and autoplay equals one text. After that, head on over to the site and post where you want it to go, and that's pretty much it. That's how to get the video to play automatically, and that works for anywhere on the web where you can post that embed code. So this is Derek Erwin signing off, and if you guys have found this information to be useful, head on over to my blog and hit the share, tweet, or even buzz, or even if you want to, bookmark all the information here. If you find this information to be helpful, or somebody else who you know might actually want this information as well. So this is Derek Erguin signing off. Have a wonderful day. I'll speak to you soon. Bye.